Well, that didn't work out too well. We got a new lucky boy. Um, I, I don't... We're, we're doing Naruto crap today. I didn't really have a Naruto figure for, to give us luck. So, uh, I figured this Golden Buddha Homer Simpson might... Might work out. So now we have a third lucky boy to assist us in our endeavors to get rare stuff from any of the things that we open. So today we're doing full booster box of these Panani Panini Panunu uh, uh, cards. I believe, yeah, there are 24 packs in here, nine cards per pack. And we have something special. To be fair, it's not super special, but I think it's really cool and I really wanted it. Um, I got my hands on, and this is just the box that it kind of shipped in. This boy. This is a kit that they would actually send out to stores um, in order to basically order cards for, you know, different card stores. And there's supposed to be a promo card in here that they would send out to these stores. I don't know if there is, but there are supposed to be. So we get to open up this boy. You can only get the card from these. That so means one of the card was sent to every store, specifically card stores, that carried the Panini Panani Naruto cards, which weren't as popular as the main line because those were actually playable and these are just like collecting. So I don't think there are a whole lot of these out there, but they're also not the hardest thing to get your hands on. I'm just happy it's in very good condition. And it was sent to me in this like uh, comic uh, holder. So it's it was pretty well packaged. But first, we got to cut into this. Come on, come on, open up. Now I did see one thing in here. I noticed when this thing was sealed, um, here on the side, there's something inserted right there. And we're gonna figure out what that thing is. All right, figure I'd go ahead and actually open up the top of that, you know, make it all pretty. Uh, when you, you know what? I'm not super worried about those little guys. Um, yeah, screw it, we'll do it. We'll, we'll do that, just make it all pretty. You know, you, you, got, you guys deserve the best, I think. I, I, I don't know any of you. All right, so let's open up our first one. So like I was saying before, oh, I forgot. Okay, I, I forgot the insert. I, <laughs> I literally just mentioned it. So it's actually a Sakura card. Um, so I'm guessing it's a promo BL2. I'm guessing this is a promo card that you can only get from the booster box. So that's pretty neat, I suppose. But this is more of what we're expecting inside of these. They're like character cards and stuff like that. Um, I don't actually know how many there are. It might say here on the pack. Um, there are nine per pack. Okay, so there are 72 in the base set, not including foils or anything like that. Um, it's guaranteed that we're, with the Panini guarantee, that we're going to get the full base set within this box, at least. So then, there are chase cards. There are nine Ninja Warriors foil cards, approximately one in seven packs. There are six Friends and Foes foil cards, one in 11. And six Super Deformed die-cut cards, one in 11. I don't know what they mean with super deformed. I, I'm, I'm clueless on that. But let's just open this up. So at least we know we're going to be getting the whole base set. So we have Gara, Tamari, and Konkuro. We have the second exam survivors. And like I said, these all have like information on the back, which is just really neat if you're a super big thing of the show. This is pre Shaputin. These cards are pretty old. We have Akamaru from my favorite boy, Kiba. We have Team 7, Tintin, Neji, and Rock Lee. Kashi and Zaiwuza, Shikamaru, Gara, and Naruto. So no foils on the first one. One thing I don't like though is that all these packs do look the same. I mean, it, it's how most card games do their thing. Like, you know, the, the non-giant name ones. Well, I guess Naruto is kind of a big name, but you know. We have Ten Ten. We have Rookies. Sasuke, Edgelord. Naruto being an Edgelord. That was actually from the first episode. Uh, Sasuke and Ino. Um, what is this? Um, the, what, what is this? It's card number one. So it's an actual card. It's just, okay. I guess when you like put these in a binder or something, that makes sense to be the first thing you see. Okay. Um, we have a sumo. I expected it to be a, uh, a, a, a list, by the way. I actually loved him and, you know, up until he died. Uh, Dosu and lastly, Sakura. Next. Open. I keep looking at the back card. 
Okay, we have Sandy Boy Gara, Kakashi, Orochimaru, map. We have a map! Why? It's a map. Okay, so it's Team 7 with Kakashi this time around. Uh, we have Kanahamaru's group. I like how a lot of these groups, they're listing every character. Even when there are four, it lists out all of their names. For Kanahamaru's group, it just says Kanahamaru's group. They have names. I don't remember them because they don't matter, but they have names. Rock Lee, Naruto, it's actually like a full art. That's kind of cool. And of course we have Kurenai, as we just revealed. Neat. Also, um, I didn't know that. I just spotted that. Birthday, October 10th. Naruto was born two days after me. Well, neat. All right. This time, not going to look at the back card like a moron. We have Kabuto. Um, I actually liked him a lot during the tuning exams. I know he ended up being like evil and stuff. I still liked his fighting style and all that. Uh, up until the Orochimaru crap happened, um, you know, with him going mentally insane, I still liked him even as a villain. He was really cool. He, he wasn't my favorite villain, but he was way up there. Uh, we have Ino, Haku, Sakura crying, like always, Kiba, Shino, and Hinata, I hate what they did to you and Baruto. Uh, then again, that show's not that great anyways. Baki, Ibiki, Abuki, oh, Kakashi, uh, Guy, and actually that is our last one, cool. So yeah, these kind of cards, just like, you know, most of the Paninis and... Uh, like wax packs and stuff, they usually just have, uh, you know, a base set, usually around 70 cards or so, and all of the cards in that are the same rarity, and then trying to get the actual foils and stuff... Hold on. Nope, nope. Poke yourself back out. Poke yourself back out. Get focused already, camera. Do you see that? There's something round in here. Naruto, Sasuke, and Sakura. Aruka. Third Hokage. I Ibisu? I don't remember how to pronounce his name. Oh. Oh. That is different. Super... Super deformed. That's a super deformed card. Oh. Okay. That is really cool. So we got number five. I didn't expect to find these already. Dude, Homer, you are helping us out today, boy. All right, so we actually do have a checklist. Of course, it is card number 72. So, you know, whatever. Um, Kiba, Akamaru, Naruto, and Zaku. Zaku! And actually, this super deformed card, I I'm not just going to throw in the pile like I did the others. What do you have? Bless us, Golden Homer. Give us the cards that we require. We have Kiba Boy again. Sakura and Kakashi, Orochimaru, I actually like that this card features uh, him in the tuning exams when he's like in disguise. Uh, Sakura being lame as usual. We got Naruto and Sakura foil. I kind of like how this is done with Sakura being on the front, you know, in front of him. She's foil and he's not. It gives like another layer of depth. I kind of like that. Uh, I don't really know. So that is a friends and foes card. Okay. And it's number three. Sweet. Sasuke, Konkuro, and Hinata. Oh, there's another. Yeah, group 7. Okay. So, Naruto is cut off. Does that mean that there's another part of this card? It's just card number 3. So I'm guessing that means there's another part of this card. Yeah, actually, it shows it there. We have one half. Well, neat. Next up, and I promise, guys, I will open the envelope soon. I am as excited as you are, but... How would this video be any fun if I showed you um, the possible promo card at the beginning of the video? Or at the end? We gotta mix it in the middle somewhere. Okay, we have Neju! He dead! Sorry for all the spoilers. Uh, Sasuke, Kiba, Sakura, and Kakashi, they're both dead too. Orochimaru, uh, Asuma, Kurenai, and Kakashi, Susuke. Uh, Kankuro and Hinata. You know, I could have said Kanker Sore instead of Kankuro. Um, that probably would have been funnier, but I'm not a comedian. I'm barely a YouTuber. I'm just the guy who likes to unbox things and play video games, and for some reason I recorded myself doing it so the world can know how terrible of a, you know, nerd I am. Alright, we got Sakura again, Guy and Rock Lee. Shikamaru, Soji, and Ino, Ten Ten, the Rookies. Group 7, the same half. 
Shoji. That card again. Atsuma. We're getting a lot of repeats already. Now, I actually did have a couple of these cards growing up. Um, but here's the thing, whenever I bought them, I didn't want them. I liked the trading cards. I still have a binder full of them, me and Anna kind of come out of our collection. Um, although I don't have as many as I did when I was younger. I wanted the trading cards, not these. Um, and to be fair, I liked these. They were cool. I had nothing against them. I, I definitely appreciated having them. But it kind of sucked when you're trying to trading cards and you get these, because you were too dumb to realize that these aren't the same thing. Um... A bit more misleading for the children out there. But we actually had a couple of these cards. Me and Anna did. I'm probably only like three or four. I don't know where they are. We I couldn't find them. I was gonna look for them for this video. Um come on, Edge Lord, there you are. Sasuke and Ino, Sandgara, Kakashi reading his pornography. Orochimaru, sorry, I'm getting the like, chest congestion. Sakura, Kanahamaru's group, Rock Lee, and Naruto again. Also, now that I'm doing Naruto stuff, I can finally say, you know, online, like, to a group of people, to something that's going to be, like, permanently posted until YouTube takes down my channel for doing something stupid. Um, fuck people who say Naruto. Like, they, how the fuck do they say it? They, like, they overpronunciate, like, every letter in his fucking name. Like, in the show, they call him Naruto. That is his name. That's the name of the show. It's not Naruto. Like, fuck off. I hate people that do that. Anyways, we got map again. Team 7, Neji, Inka, that's another new one. Rock Lee, Full Art, Kuranai, Kakashi, Tamari, Ken, and that's it. These cards are thick. I keep thinking that, like, I'm on the last one, and I'm not. Alright, that one opened really easy. Okay. Full Art Sakura. There we go. Hayate. Zabuza. I, I loved him. Kakashi. And we have a Ninja Warriors foil. Okay. You think he would have been like the friend and foe thing, possibly, but hey, another holo. Um, there's the other half of Group 7. Thank God. We have Haku, Sasuke, Edgelord, and Ashino. So I'm calling it now. My recording is going to try and stop the second I open this envelope. But we are going to do it. Now, you guys might have noticed something. This is from the Secret Weapons release that was coming in June 2007. These, however, are not that. These are the Ninja Ranks, which I believe was the set before that, uh, for the Secret Weapons one. Why am I opening these instead of Secret Weapon then? Because they're hard as crap to find and I don't know why. First off, they sell for a lot more than these. I can buy like a pack for like seven or eight dollars. They sell for a lot more and I don't have that kind of money to buy that many of them for a video. And even then, like, I can only find them from like, like pretty shady sh sellers. Um, of course, I oh, it was actually partially torn. I wanted to try and find a way to open this safely. But it's already torn. All right, we're just gonna tear it all the rest of the way up to the top. And then I'm going to see if I can cut through it. And right then and there, my camera is trying to overheat. I'm gonna go uh, try and safely open this while I let my camera cool down. I won't peek inside and I will be back. Okay, so I kind of regret tearing that the rest of the way. Um, I know it was already torn, so who really cares? Because what we ended up doing we've, was just uh, cutting a really tiny sliver off the side. We kind of decided that was probably the best way to do it. So I do kind of regret doing that, but it's not a big deal. Like, I'm, I'm worrying about it way too much. So, that is everything in the envelope, and let's just go in order. So let's see here, this is just the order sheet. It, wow, 10 box case, $286, okay. And boxes are $38 for a 24 count. I wish we got those kind of prices that the stores get, holy crap. Alright, then, what is this? I guess this is just like marketing for it and showing like what kind of stuff is going to be in there. Neat. And here is our card. Oh, no, I'm sorry, Homer. So there is a promo card. It's not a foil, though. You kind of think it would be, right? Shadow Clone Jutsu. Again, not a foil, just glossy. Um, okay, I mean, it's, it's an exclusive thing. Because on the back of it, you actually just have this. It just tells you about it coming up soon, stuff like that. Now that I think about it, I've seen these cards selling individually on eBay. Now it makes sense. They're promo cards. So, okay, that's pretty cool. 
And the last thing that's in here is this. I'm guessing it's like a poster. Okay, yeah, it's just like, uh, let me try to, try to, there we go. It's like a promotional poster. That's neat. I guess we could possibly do something with this, but I'll probably just keep it in the envelope, keep it safe. Okay, well, you were only here for that. There you go. You can leave now. Please don't. I need the watch time. Okay, next pack. I was still way too excited for that. I'm just happy that we have that promo card, but it sucks I don't have any other cards from that series. Um, at least I have something special for it. You know, eventually I'll pick up cards in that series, hopefully. Um, and if I do, they will be here on the YouTube channel. Neji, Enko, Rock Lee, Sakura, Hayate. Was that Full Art Lee card new? I don't think it was. Kakashi, Tamari, Ken. We got the other half group seven again. So at least we can complete the group seven card, you know, twice now. Possibly more. We might have gotten more of them and I just didn't realize it. All right, Magic Art, Homer, come on. Give me another foil. Give me one of the distorted die cuts. All right, Edgelord, focus. Come on. There you go. We got Naruto. We have I saw a foil. You know, Sasuke and Eno. We have Gara. We have. Foil Full Art Neji, also the Ninja Warrior one, which I believe was the most common kind of foil. Dosu, Sakaru, Konohamaru, Rock Liu. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that that was the most common kind of foil. Um, yeah, nine Ninja Warriors, one in seven. Friends and Foes is one in 11, and die, uh, the Super Deformed Die Cut are one in 11 as well. So at least we've gotten, you know, at least two of the one in 11s. I suppose that's, you know, Pretty standard for a 24 count box. All right, next. Come on, open. Come on, you know you want to open. There you go. All right. What do we have here? Maybe another deformed die cut, hopefully? I doubt it. But I did ask Homer and Magic Heart for luck, and they did send me a foil, so I can't complain. We got Kakashi reading his porn. We have Fuller Orochi Maru. We have Map, my favorite card. Uh, Team 7. Ooh, okay. Friends and Foes Foil. Freaking sweet. So that's another 1 out of 11. Naruto Fox Spirit. I really like that. Once again, the background character being uh, Kurama is also not foil. Naruto, Kurenai, Kakashi, and Tamari. So I am assuming that there's only, gonna, only ever going to be one foil per pack. Um, you would think. But I wonder if there is a chance that you can get two from one. I really doubt it. I'm guessing that, like, it is seeded out. But if it's not, there is a chance, I suppose, that you could. I don't see it happening. Okay, we keep getting Neji as our first card. Am I, am I, am I wrong on that? I think we've seen, like, three times as the front card. Enko again. Rock Lee. Sakura. Is this the same pack? Is this the same pack as the one we did before? Hayate. Ken. Other half group seven, Haku and Sasuke. Okay, it changed up a little bit. I don't think we've seen that Edgelord Sasuke yet. That was kind of when he was like at his coolest in the original show, though, during the Zabuza um, saga. You can say whatever you want about him being an Edgelord. You can't deny that he wasn't, you know, the be one of the best parts of Team Seven. I mean, Naruto is just really annoying. Sakura is also really annoying. Speaking of, um, but Kakashi was cool. Okay, I actually kind of like that. This is both of them being pissed off at Naruto. That's a new one. Aruka. Why does it... It has, like, the fog around him. That's weird. Third Hokage. Guy. <laughs> Checklist. Kiba Akamaru and a different Naruto card. Well, sweet. So I guess the facts on these will be different um, with a different art, I would assume. All right, we don't have too many left now. I think after... I think we're on our... Seven, like we have seven more including this one, but I'm not really counting counting. I just kind of glanced over it. We have Aruka Focus, Third Hokage, Ibisu, Abesu, Neji, Sasuku, Kiba and Akamaru, the same Naruto card again, Zaku, and the, the, the people. You know, say what you want about those fake Pokemon cards that we unboxed. They were the easiest packs to open. To be fair, it probably protected them poorly because they're really cheap plastic to wrap them, but like not like this is going to protect cards much, like... So at least those were easy to open. So a lot of card packs are just kind of a pain. Team 7, Team whatever number, 
Kabuto, Ino, Haku Full Art, Naruto, Baki, Abiki, Kakashi. God, it's like I'm doing the freaking Pokemon rap, but for Naruto. This probably won't be the longest video. I've been doing a, every video I've been doing on this channel has been stupid long. All right. Ino, Haku, Sakura, Kiba Boys, Naruto Boys, Biki, Kakashi, Guy, and Checklist. My favorite card is Checklist. All right, we looked at the back card again, whatever. All right, we got Akamaru. I think I saw a flash. This pack might be a lucky one. Naruto, Sakura, and Sasuke, Tintin, Neji, and Rock Lee, Kabuto, and... Hell yes, Ninja Warrior again, so the most common kind of foil, but still another full art foil of Rock Lee. I love this dude. They should have had like drunk, uh, Drunken Fist Rock Lee, honestly. That would have been better. Um, Shikamaru, we got a full art Gara. I think that one is new as well. Naruto and Baki Baki Baki. All right, that's actually the last pack from that side. That one actually opened really easy. Okay, I get uncomplaining. Zabuza, Full Art Kakashi, Focus, come on, there's Zabuza, Kakashi, Gar's team, second exam survivors again, and another foil, it is a die cut, deform, super deform die cut card, it also says 5-0, isn't that what Sasuke said? Oh, it says SD, super deformed, okay. So they're actually SD3 and 4. Got it. Well, we have two parts of, T of Team 7 as a super die cut. Last two. What sucks is that's probably going to be the last like great thing we get from these last packs. All right, Zabuza, Kakashi. We're getting to so many of these in the same order. Gara's team again. Second team advisor survivors, Akamaru, Shino, Zabuza, and Kakashi. Shikamaru and Full Art Gara. Okay, last pack. Now, I already partially opened it, but Homer, come on, you gotta give it that kiss. There you go. Uh, ma 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 Magikarp, come on, you gotta do the same thing. You, you, your mouth is made for this, all right? There you go. This, this pack has now been blessed by our two lucky boys, and Psyduck's just kind of here hanging out. So, we're gonna have something good in here to finish this video off with, because I don't really have much else planned. Uh, Ibesu, focus! Ibesu, we have Full Art Neji. I think that's a new Sasuke, Maybe, pro probably not. Kiba, Kakashi, and Sakura, Zaku, them again. That is a new Sasuke. And Konkuro. So hopefully we do have a full set. It, it is their guarantee, but I know there's still a chance that they messed something up and I might not have gotten a full set of the base set. Obviously not the foils. But cool, that is all of them, but we have one more thing left to do. There we go, made the background even more cluttered, yet pretty for you guys. Like the last so many videos, we're opening up another one of these playing card decks of Seven Deadly Sins. If you haven't seen them, go watch the other videos! Anyways, we've already opened the first four, being Lust, Greed, which was my favorite one of these, Sloth, Wrath, and now Envy, which I'm not sure if I'm going to care for. If you guys have seen the others, you already know what I mean. The, uh, all the cards are going to have, well, the red cards and the face cards are going to have that, like, green tint to it, as this box is green. I hope it's more of a vibrant. That's why I like Greed. The yellow was very vibrant. Um, I don't remember what video that was in, but with this being the fifth box that we're opening, that means to go back four videos, and it's going to be in that one. Focus, come on, there we go. So that is the Envy box. And that will be the art that is on the back of the cards themselves, and we can go ahead and take this out and see the full, beautiful design here. Now obviously this isn't hand-drawn like the back of the cards are, like that's the hand-drawn part, obviously this is not. Um, but on the inside, yet again, we have the uh, Joker card, which is always the devil or just a demon. I'm assuming it's the devil. So let's get focused, and there are Jokers. There's our ace, same as always. If we cut down here, yes, it is that shade of green. So we have deck, queen, king, next ace, then all of these will have that shade of green to replace the red cards. I think that is, like, for them not doing a whole lot with these cards to make the fronts more personalized, that is the coolest thing that they have done. Um, I do like that. So then we have the green, jack, queen, king, then we go back to blacks with the 
Ace, go back through these. We have more of the green boys. There's our next ace. And we go through to the end to our last jack, queen and king. And of course, they all have that beautiful art on the back. I love these things. I, I, I am ready to open up more deck boxes in these videos. Oh, that last video, well, it wasn't the last one. Was it the last one? In a previous video where we opened up these Pokemon round playing cards that are made specifically for the game Rummy, um, I had originally ordered these and intended for them to be opened at the end of a video like these other deck boxes that we've been doing after the seven of the Deadly Sins ones were done. And I forgot about that and just opened it up in the middle of a video. So, um, yeah, there's that. Yes, I mean, that means I have to order more unique uh, card things in order to, you know, end my videos off on. All right, guys. Well, that is going to be it. I need to actually put the cards back in here later on as well. Um, if you enjoyed, feel free to like the video, subscribe to the channel. We're doing all kinds of weird crap. And hopefully I'll see you all next time. Bye.